and welcome to the first edition of the UIU How To, a Big Bang LLC support production. I'm your host, Jason Stewart, and today we will be walking through the task of downloading and executing the UIU standard product. To get started, the first thing you will need is your license certificate that will have been provided to you by our sales team. If you have not been in contact with our sales team yet, you can begin the process of acquiring a free trial by visiting uiu4u.com and filling out the free trial request form. Just click on free trial and fill out your information here. Once you have acquired your license certificate, the three most important pieces of information will be your login, your password, and your license key. These will be used when running the product. To begin the download, if you have the license PDF available, you can simply click on the hyperlink provided at the bottom of the PDF, and it will take you to the download page where you can enter your information, your login, and your password. If you do not have the PDF available, but do otherwise have your login and password available, you can access downloads page by navigating to the support area of the UIU website and clicking the downloads tab. You can then enter your login and password here, click submit, and the download will begin. Once you have clicked Submit, a pop-up will come up and you will be able to begin your UIU download. The process works the same for both the trial and the live versions. Once you have extracted the contents of the zip file, you should move these to your chosen media. For example, a USB flash drive that has been formatted for NTFS. NTFS formatting is required as our driver database has exceeded 8 gigabytes and FAT32 will only support file sizes up to 4 gigabytes. It is at this point that you would then move to your prepared base image to run the UIU and prep the image for universal deployment. To run the UIU double-click on the executable file, and you will be presented with the license agreement. Find your key from your license certificate, and enter it into the license key area. For trial users, you will also need to scroll to the bottom of the license agreement in order to highlight the next button. The UIU will first warn you about maintaining a base image, which is required for UIU support. For trial users, it will then give you a trial notice outlining the limitations of the image that will pre be prepared with this trial software. After agreeing to the conditions, you will be presented with the main menu for the UIU software. This concludes the first episode. Thank you very much for watching.